Welcome to the Empire Blade, this is Rampain, and welcome back to my Clan of Crowns campaign. We're going to continue we left off from last time, where once again I'm having to kick the Skyrims out of Hammerfell. Uh, we'll see how well this goes. They have a lot of town guardsmen, as always, as they've had in the past. Uh, they don't have just a scout leading them, so it might be difficult for me to kill Raloff, but hopefully I can get them to drop their ram and their siege tower, and then I should be able to hold this kind of just as well as we had last time. We have a little bit more cavalry here. And so that should be a little bit easier to take them out. I might be able to kill the generals because I have the other cab unit. Because at least Skyrim cab isn't as powerful or as hard-hitting as the Imperial cab. And so they die a little bit easier. And good, they're attacking the section that has more towers active. Okay, so what you guys are going to do is you're going to be... If I can adjust you. Come on. Come on, guys. I hate the pathing! Okay, just, just stand where you are. Uh, everybody else down off the walls. I'll try and just move you here. Because I want my archers. If they do get through, the archers... Would, oh, actually, they've got their... Their ladders will go here. Hmm. The, the one problem with this setup... Because this area is great because it has so many towers here... But, that means also I don't get to have my archers, like I can't put my archers here, I can't put my archers here because there's just too many of them, I, can put them, I can't even put them there. So honestly, sometimes it's just best to leave you guys where you are, like, around down here. We want you to just have the towers active anyway, so I'll kind of have one to each side. I'll have it so that uh, you guys, actually I can put more there, I'll put the other unit there. Because this is the main area I'm going to have to defend anyways, so like, you guys go there. You guys just kind of chill here. Let's see my general, and then where's the other cab? You are way far away. Oh, come on! I know you can go this way, damn it. Like, dude, I know you can. The general can go this way, why can't you? Eh, eh. Let me try just a little bit longer, and then I'll just fucking deal with it. I probably just gotta deal with it. Because I should still be able to have them get the ram down and the siege tower down. Uh, siege tower first, as once that's in place, I can't stop it. And so, let's just start charging you guys out. Get going. I'm actually going to have you guys cease fire for now. I want you to hold on to your ammo just for now. As you might not be able to properly do as much damage as I like. But no, general, just run over here. You guys, I'm going to have you try and run out. You'll be the ones that go hit the ram. And I'll have my general be the one that hits the siege tower. Drop those guys, and then... Oh, wait, no, the General's Bodyguard is uh, on the ground. I always I always forget about that with Skyrim, that they have uh, a dismounted General. Oh, it's so much easier for me, actually, then. I should be able to kill him. Because you guys just get out of there. Start charging the Siege Tower. Come on, get in there. You guys are moving in slowly. They do have a decent amount of archers, so I do need to be careful. Make sure they don't shoot me. So, drop that. And then run this way. Go, go, go. Ram is dropped as well. Kind of run over this way. Make sure the gates close. There we go. So now we're going to run around. And I'll try and kill their general. Go, go, go. Because now they've only used... Okay, you're not picking that back up. You're not picking that back up. Good. Okay. Because now I can funnel you. And what I'll do is you guys move right there. I'm actually going to move both my archers to about here. Because they shouldn't get in the gates, I can now just have it so that you guys, once they get up here, I can just shoot them. Good, you guys have distracted them. Okay, now just focus on the ladders, please. Because what I'm going to have you do is kind of run around. The captain, no, the general's right here on this side, so I'll try and get a good charge on you. So kind of run around this way. Those are archers. So give them a wide berth. I don't want to get too close to them. As those guys could do a bit of damage to us right now, as they have a lot of archers. So you guys too, kind of run around. Want to give them a wide berth. We don't want to let them shoot me and just kill all my cav here. So let's speed that up. Let's ignore them. Wait until they start getting up on the walls. Until they we properly engage them. As I want them to be distracted by the assault our and not focus on their general. Because those guys are advancing forward. Work. Just ignore their archers for a little bit longer. Because they've got... Like four units of archers... No, they have like five. They have like five units of archers. At least they're not picking up any of the other siege equipment pieces. Uh, I'm going to move you up a little closer if you can. Try and get more of these towers active. Ah, oh, no, none of them are activating. What about if you go there? Yeah, that's what I want to see. 
Let's get more of the towers active. Okay, now they're all rushing forward. Oh, the general's running too. Uh, we might not be able to get him. Although, if he is rushing up onto the walls, he should die. Oh, no, here he is. Okay, so let's run you guys right there. So far, number wise, how are we doing? 19% of their forces are already dead. Okay. The captain... The general, I mean, sorry, he's right here. He's the one with the furs. Okay. Try and start charging him. I want to try and see if I can get him to run over this way. Face me, damn you! Because as soon as you die, everybody else should be pretty easy. He's already dead. Okay, run out of there. We don't need to fight now. We don't need to have my cab in here. Now we just want to wait until we can run them all down. Oh, yes, I love that we got him in the first charge. Fuck yes. Okay, so now everybody else should break pretty easily. You guys are holding them at bay here. Good job. Keep that up. The only unit I'm really worried about is their heavy Skyrim swordsmen. Uh, or heavy Skyrim warriors. Yeah. And those guys are so far dying really nicely. I'll wait a little bit longer, because once they... Uh, if they get a foothold up here, I, I can then turn my archers on and have them shoot them. Because you guys should have a pretty good line of sight right now. Yeah. But no, at this point right now, we're just waiting. Waiting until we've got a good chance to try and run them all down. Now, despite what the announcer is saying, I think we're doing very well so far. Uh, they've barely got... Okay, they have a, some guys on the walls now. I'll turn you on, have you start shooting them. Because this one unit so far has done as much as they really can. Uh, I might send you guys up in a second here. But once they get to about 50% of their forces have lost, I think at that point I'm going to start trying to see if I can have it so you guys will uh, have my cap charge in there and try and kill them if they're able to. But you know, you guys, they're kind of just sitting here, but just try and shoot these guys that are up here, primarily. You should have a really good line of sight on those guys. Well, you're kind of missing right now. But no, just get to them to 50%, and I think once my cab charge in, they might break at that point. There's not that much. Oh, there's a chain route starting already. Maybe now. Let's, let's try charging now. It's a little earlier than I wanted. But once we get the chain, chain route started, the rest of this force is dead. They're all town guardsmen. Oh, yes. Look at that. Yeah, see you announcer, man. <laughs> you don't know what you're talking about. You gotta wait until you see the full scope of the battle. They have lost half As their right men. now, they have now lost 58. Oh, some of them are still fighting here. A lot of them are breaking. Let's pull out of there. Let's try and go for the guys that are breaking. Ignore those uh, cab units. Oh, they are not going to ignore me. So let's just try and kill them off here. Get rid of them. There we go. Our now they're breaking. Winning the battle. If we okay. continue now like I start running guys down as there's a you. lot of them. Yeah. They've already lost two-thirds of their forces. At this point... I can probably start causing just a bunch of cycle charges into the enemy and just run them all down. Man, it's battles like this that have really contributed to me being so fucking cocky in this campaign. Uh, I really need to check myself because I know like last video I probably was pushing my limit. We still have to actually see how badly certain things are going to end up with for us because of uh, how aggressive I was trying to be. But like, right now I know one thing I'm going to be trying to do is once we get back to my turn on the campaign map, I want to try and check out and actually scout out around Strosa Mackay. I'm assuming that it was going to be filled with Restless League forces, as that's what I've seen it be uh, composed of in the past. And it sounds like that might not be the case in the current version of the mod. And so I want to double check that, make sure... Can I run? Will you let me leave? Will you let me leave? Otherwise, it might be best for me to try and fight here. Because... No, they outnumber me so much. They have a number of almost 3 to 1. Will you let me get away? They'll let me get away over there. This area, I'm actually more okay with trying to fight. Oh, God. So, if I go to this spot over here, that'll probably be the best for me. The reinforcing army is the one with the general. Oh, they've got some good units there. But no, this one I think I will fight, because this force is way better than the other army that I had over there. I probably have a much better chance at beating them here than over there. Because these guys only outnumber me, they only have about 50% more than me, instead of just almost three times as much as me. And so, let's hope, because I want to try and go over here. 
this area might be decently mountainous, and if it is, and I can beat this force back here, I should be able to get the city, or get the castle. So, at least one of the battles I got away with. So, I can pull back uh, around Skaven, we'll pull back, get some more men, um, and maybe come back at a later date. Ooh, this is actually looking good for us. The area I want to be is right up. Oh, yeah, that's what I want. That is what I want. I want some sort of hill! So, the enemy reinforcements are going to be coming from down here. The other guys are going to be coming from right here. Otherwise, I could... No, I, I think we will go up here. We'll go right up here. This is a pretty decent spot for us to set up. It's very mountainous. The enemy reinforcements will have a fair distance to run around. And then I've got five cab units. I'll have to make sure to utilize the uh, superior mobility. Otherwise, we're dead. <laughs> At least you guys have a lot of uh, experience. Like, you guys have seven experience points. So your attack is 14 right now. Damn. That's actually pretty good. Uh, you guys, six, six. It's mainly you guys. These uh, Alakir uh, Lancers are pretty disgusting, actually, for right now. Their attack is pretty high. It's actually higher than my cap, my general. Wow, okay. Well, let's start that, because what we're going to do is ideally, okay, because I'm going to actually line up up here, now that I can move my guys here, so like more so like that, archers line up to about here, and then cav, I need to kill their captain as quickly as possible. Honestly, what are you doing? Are you going to group up with your allies? Because if you guys are going to move over and group up with your allies... I could have maybe tried to walk over here and take this hill instead. This is a much better hill for me. Now, you guys didn't have that many archers, from what I remember. And then who's here? So these are just all... Actually, I don't think you have any archers. That undead unit's gonna suck. No, you have no archers. Okay. So, their current captain, I'm assuming, is this guy. Knights of the Wheel. Yeah, it's the Knights of the Wheel unit. Okay. So, right now... I need to somehow single you out. I can't very easily do that right now for where I'm at. What are their allies doing? Like, I don't. at the moment, they're standing on top of their hill. They're not advancing on me, which is kind of strange, as they're the aggressors in this battle. And so, like, these guys... It feels like they might try and group up with their allies and then attack me. This kind of feels like what's going to happen. So they might tire themselves out. You guys are kind of walking this way. Kind of. If you do, I'm probably going to have to adjust you guys a little bit more. Because it feels like they're going to try and assault from this position. So let's kind of move here. And then adjust you guys a little bit. So it's a bit thicker lines. Right about there. There you go. And then archers, I'll adjust you guys just a little bit more. Because at the moment, it does feel like you guys will group up and they're going to attack just from right here. So that actually works out very well for me. Oh, come on, I wish that they're knights of... I wish you guys were in an easy area for me to kill you. I could go kill the uh, name general of the other force. Because he's way over here. Is he actually in a... Is he more open? Ooh, he is more open. Yeah, he's right there. Let's go do that. Because right now, I can't very easily try and kill the uh, captain over there. So I'm going to try and kill this guy. Because if he dies, and his men are going to start breaking, it'll be a lot easier for me to take them out. Although, if you guys commit up here, I'll have to bring my cab back around. Which, it kind of feels like they're almost going to try and do that. Let's see if we can maybe... Oh, he's kind of more open now. I'm going to go up and around this way and see if I can maybe get you. Because they feel like they're kind of advancing on me. Yeah, no, at this point they do. Okay, so we're going to try and loop around up to here. I want to try and get up here. And then... Try and kill you, Knights of the Wheel! Oh, no, don't go that way. Or at least kind of wait. Because they might just open themselves up. Let's wait, let's wait, wait right here. They are sending some guys up a little bit faster now with their forces over there. Oh, come on. This, I, I hate the anticipation of waiting for them to see what they're going to do. Because it does feel like they're going to try and assault me from right here. Come on, I want you to open up your captain, man. I might have anything, I might just charge this guy. I need to beat you back down, because you are a tough unit. Come on, it's... Like, you were so vulnerable the first time, now you're not. Ah! 
Let's see, what are these units? What are they running up forward with? Uh, oh, these are archers. Fuck them. <laughs> I'm just gonna kill them immediately. These guys are vulnerable out and alone. It's two archer units that are trying to run over here. They'll probably die. Everybody else should be okay over here. They are advancing on us. Archers, as soon as you can, I need you to start shooting their nice of the wheel unit. So I'll keep trying to hit them every once in a while. You guys are going to be trying to charge and kill these archers of theirs. As I'm assuming that these guys will break pretty easily as they're just archers. And they've been running along a decent chunk of the map. Uh, they actually feel pretty good about that. Really? Oh man, you guys do. Okay, let's get you out of here. Pull back. Yeah, damn it, I can't move you properly. Just run this way. Archers, uh, can you shoot the guy yet? Nope. Okay, just keep picking your own targets. All of my cav back off for now. Go back here. Oh my god, you guys don't want to do what I want you to. It's all these fucking pebbles. Okay, get away from them. You did a little bit of damage. Not nearly as much as I would have liked, though. Come on, get out of there, guys. You've taken minimal damage so far, so we can get away Scott's free for now. Get back over here. Archers, come on, tell me that cab unit's close enough. Nope, they are not close enough at all. Uh, Number-wise, they have killed 5% of their forces so far. They are they are not making up their minds on what they want to do. Okay, so I'm going to have it so you guys... The general's still pretty vulnerable over here. So I think I'm going to try and go for the name general. If I can get you guys to move! Oh my god! hate the pathing right now in this area. Because he's right here. I could probably charge him and maybe kill him. Not going to be able to easily get those guys. Oh, we could kill this Nomad Cat unit first. Let's do that. This unit's out and alone. Any units we can take out that are alone, I might as well. Still... Oh my god, bring your goddamn knights to the wheel over here. Okay, no, now you can hit them. Okay, so open up on them. You guys... Where'd he go? Oh, he ran away, you fucking coward. Okay, I'm going to ignore them. I'm going to make my way back over here. I need to focus this force down first. So let's bring them over. The Knights of the Wheel are dying. They've lost two, got three guys so far. So I'll bring my cab back over this way. Because right now... What are you guys doing? Like, they're trying to fight me up here, but they're just doing a really piss poor job of it so far. It's fine by me. Because right now, I have killed 10% of their forces. Ooh, the general's right here. Hello, Cav. Would you please kindly focus down this captain here? So just try and surround him if you can. There you go. We got at least one unit to try and catch him. Try and have my general kind of run around from behind to properly charge him. I don't like this. You guys run over there. Try and stop them. That's not what I'm trying to tell you to do. Run up this way. Engage them. You guys kind of pull back a little bit. There you go. Cav have engaged this guy, kind of fully and surround him. He's already lost a decent chunk of his dudes. He's at 27 now. Number wise, uh, these are all my guys, yep. 4 to 15. Oh, come on, I have to win this fight. I have to win this fight. If we lose this fight, this is going to bode horrendously for this campaign right now. So you guys, I'm going to leave you as you are. You can probably help out in a little bit. But you guys right here, how's he doing? He is now at... Oh, he's fighting to the death. 17. Okay, so he's fighting to the death. Archers, I'm gonna have you cease fire, then pick your own targets. We've captured the enemy yeah! Okay. Teach the cowardly dog to so he's now captured. Run. Now we can try and focus Rest on this force up leisure. here. Uh, you come over here. Try and surround them. Oh, there we go. Oh, yeah, that's a chain route already. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay, let's get back up here. Let's try and get rid of this Nomad Light Cab unit here. Uh, you turn around. Try and focus that unit. You can't properly brace, but at least you can turn around in time. And then I'll bring you guys up and around this way. Over this way, come on. Ignore those guys that you're fighting right here. As I don't think you're going to easily break them right now. Let's see, they're kind of the general for the other army. He's still very slowly walking up. Okay. Number-wise, how are we doing so far? 7 to 24. Ooh, that's good. Okay, run these guys down. Basically, I want you guys to run up around this way. And we'll kind of try and have it so that once you're on this ledge again, we can try and run these guys all down. Oh, actually, some of them already ran off the map. 
Because I only really care about running them off the map at this point. I don't think I need to try and kill all of them. I don't think so. I think we'll be just fine if I can get them all run off the map. Because uh, the reinforcing army, you guys, only half the enemy you're all dead. If, if I win this fight, you're all dead. And you can't do anything to really stop me. Uh, the other army, I guess I could try and get more of them if possible. I want to try and get more of them, but I just don't know how likely it's going to be that we'll actually beat them back. Okay, let's kind of speed this up a little bit. You guys are shaking. Come on, break them, please. Please, please, please. They don't want to break. Oh, come on, you're supposed to be helping out. Just to try and break them so they can be captured. There we go. Because then, slow it down a little bit. You guys... Keep pushing into this unit. Oh, actually, that one's the vampire unit. Okay, try and run up around this way. Well, there's not many of them over there, actually. Well, try and kind of run around this way so I can get a proper t uh, way to flank this unit here. Because he's got 21 guys left. He's not going to break. We have to just straight up kill him. And so I'll just try and surround him, finish him off. 18, 17, 16, there we go. That's going to be much better. And then they do have some guys back here still. Try and kind of run up this way, and then that infantry unit, I need you to turn around and focus this forebearer swordsman right there. You guys are at 13. You guys keep running up this way. Archers are now out of ammo at this point, so we have to kill the enemy general that is coming up on our own. He's still kind of going around this way, so I want you guys to just try and get away from those units. Properly just run back this way... And then I'm going to have you focus on their current game in general. It seems like they're actually going to split their focus. So you guys can kind of walk over this way. They've got a couple guys over here, which I'll have stay around here, defend this spot. You guys can then try and finish him off. So speed this up a little bit as we try and walk around. A lot of you guys are already broken. So let's try and run you guys down if we can. I don't know, should I split you guys up? Oh my god, you guys are so slow! Move! Into position! Hurry up, guys! It's taking so long to get you guys in position that I keep uh, missing out on all the chances to run guys down. Like, right here. Just charge in here, and most of these guys should break, I'm assuming. Because a lot of them are already shaken. Uh, practically almost all of them are broken already. Okay, General Blasted Horn, keep giving support for my guys. Keep running them down. There you go. Focus this forebear swordsman. Because those guys are already broken. Oh, uh, I didn't realize how many guys were just right there. Pull back. Get out of there for now. Uh, you guys kind of flank around here. Is that an archer unit? That is an archer unit. Ah, damn it. And I hate that I have no more ammo. Is he any generals in here, isn't he? Yes, he is. He's got 61 guys. So yeah, pull my calf back. We need to properly surround him. And once he's dead, this red other army's completely fucked. So get out of there, guys. Kind of lure him away from his infantry. And then we can single him out on his own. I'm going to have you come around this way. You are going to try and go for that. Oh, that's the nice of the candle unit. Yep, you need to distract them. Okay, now let's focus on the bodyguard now that he's kind of away from his allies. So try and surround him. 61. Oh, come on. Get back here. I'm not done with you. My archers are already out of ammo, so I might as well have you guys try and help fight him. Yep, there we go. Now we can fully surround him. Come on. 19 to 53. Oh, he's not losing that many guys. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Like, I love defending on these mountainous regions as it makes the enemy routes more readily. But my god, does it slow my cab down. Because you guys are acting so stupid right now. Like, you guys don't know what you're doing! I'm trying to have you guys charge into the enemy general right here, but you're being very slow to react. You guys... Like, this Knights of the Candle's a pretty good unit. Hopefully you can hold them back for a little bit. Because right now, I think we should still be able to win this, but I have to kill their general. Which, he's right up here. So he's right next to my Hammerfell Swordsman, so if anybody's gonna kill him, it'll be them. You guys, I'm going to pull back a little bit, I think. I need to get rid of this unit if possible. Or just try and get a better charge into their general. No, I need to get rid of this unit first. You guys go there. You guys kind of run. Oh, ah, general's bodyguards want to chase me. 
because I want to properly surround this guy, like so. It's a Nomad Swordsman. He should break pretty easily. Uh, you're not fighting anything. Get in there and help out. Oh, actually, no. Come over here. Come over here and help out. Enemy's General Bodyguard is at 52. Come on. Finish this guy off, and then we need to go kill the General. Because they're pulling ahead more than I'd like them to right now. Ah, oh, I need to kill you. Okay, get in here. Try and help flank them. 33 to 64. Like, he has to die, but, like, this guy's in the way. Come on, come on, come on. Break, damn you. Get out of my way. Almost. Wavering. Break. Please, I need you to break sooner rather than later. Oh, come on, man. 49. Like, he's dying very slowly, but I'm worried about this section right here. Oh, no, man. Sort of now they're steady. No, die. You are so close to dead. Do I have to kill every single one of you? I feel like I'm going to. Okay, focus the nose bodyguard again. There's enough of them out of the way that I think we're good. No, you are not running away. Where'd the bodyguard go again? My general's right here. Oh, that's concerning. Theirs is where? Our men have fought long and are becoming tired. Oh, he's still right here. He, he hasn't moved. The general himself has not moved. Pull back just a tiny smidgen. And then focus him again. Because most of him... Uh, he's... Yeah, right here. I need more of my guys to focus on him specifically. And kill him off. As soon as he dies, I think we've got this. Oh, no, don't run away. Oh, where'd he go? Where'd the fucker go? Oh, here's here is. We've lost half of our Oh, come on. Die! Good tidings. The Thank you. For the moment, the oh, that was so fucking close. Okay, run them down. <laughs> My god, that took way longer than I would have liked. Uh, the Knights of the Candle, if I remember correctly, have unlimited morale, so I'm gonna ignore them. Run all these guys down. Run all of them down. I'll come back around over here, break you guys, and then all of my infantry are going to have to focus you guys. Because I'm fairly certain the Knights of the Candle have unlimited morale, so there's no reason for me to try and keep uh, running them down and breaking them. Because, yeah, they feel, feel pretty good there. Let's get you guys up here. Get a good charge on these guys the if you can. Because it's still fucking close. 55 to 79. There we go. All these guys are running. Okay, I guess they do have a, a morale that will break. Okay, let's let it run them down now. And hope nobody tries to attack me outside this castle again. Oh, now please. Don't attack me again. I've got a thousand guys left still. But, like, ugh. That was tough. That was tough. Uh, I love how, like... My archers, honestly, like, their stats are pretty bad. But for some reason, my archers actually do far better than I'd expect them to. Like, these are one of my worst units, but that guy almost got 500 kills as an archer militia. Which is kind of crazy. And that's not captured, that's just straight up kills. Now the question is, come on, please leave me alone. Oh, okay, they left me alone in one spot. How bad is this? How bad is it? Uh, they don't know me two to one. Okay. Two to one, I can usually win. Okay, I think this is okay. Um, they've got a couple archers. Just two. They have two archers. Captain is a light nomad calf, and I've got more archers at calf than them. Okay. Okay, you know, I think we can do this. I think we can do this. They are normally two to one. This will weaken their presence around Skaven a lot, and I might still be able to push for Skaven. Oh god, I need to stop being so cocky! <laughs> I need to know when to calm down, pull back, and think about things logically. Oh god. Let's see. Yeah, not the worst terrain. We can pull up a little bit further up onto this hill. Kind of hold this position. Archers right about. Maybe a little forward. Because as long as I kill their captain early on, and I can try and just start controlling the battlefield with my cav, I think we've got this. Uh, yeah, it's not that bad right there. That's not the worst there. Cav, you guys are going to have to immediately kill their captain. So, you are going to run around immediately trying to go kill him. Let everybody else advance on me. You guys make sure you have defensive stance on. Because if it's got the one cav unit, it's a uh, light nomad. 
Yeah, it's a Light Nomad Cav, so he's pretty weak. So we should be able to easily kill him. Once he's dead... Oh man, this army's gonna get fucking wrecked. Because my guys will hold long enough that I can kind of get some good hammer and anvil strikes in and properly just run them down when their morale is shattered. They've got two archers, and they're actually some of their better ones. Yeah, because the hammer fell bowmen. What are their stats? Uh, actually, that's... pretty fucking comparable to mine. What the fuck? Barely better. They have one more missile attack, one more defense, and less damage in melee attacks. My archer militia is actually pretty good in melee. Like, in comparison... Like, they're as good as my spearmen, almost. That's kind of sad. Like, at least it's their attack. Defensively, uh, they're not the best, but not bad for a flank unit. Let's hide you guys. Pull back further. I don't want you being shot at, so kind of pull back further behind. Again, wait until they've kind of committed to their fight with everybody else. Because I don't want to lose my dudes. Although, Captain's right here. Basically, I'm just going to try and run around to over this side, so that we, when we charge him, we're just going to be hitting him first, and hope we just kill him on the charge. Come on, right about there. Right about there. Charge him. Please kill him on the charge. He is a captain. Oh, he didn't die. How many men did he lose there, though? Not that many. Not that many from that charge. Okay, pull back. He actually got a more favorable trade than I did, which really annoys me. Okay, advance up the hill for me. Got some of their bowmen still around here. Yeah, come on. Come on, chase me. If one of you go there. What are you? Other way. Other way. Does he need to try and surround them? Let's see, that's a no man swordsman bowman. Come on, what are you doing? I might have to try and charge this unit here. Okay, get in there. Get in there. Try and charge him. He does not want to ignore me, but there we go. This should be at least well enough to surround him. I'm going to have to just rely on everybody else surviving for a time. As this Nomad Light Cav should die quickly enough once we have him fully surrounded. Come on, guys. Go run this way. Go, 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 go. Come on, kill the captain. You, get out of there. Get out of there. Don't fight that melee unit. Just... Oh, we have to actually get out of here. All of us. Aha! Perfect timing. Okay, get out of there. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Ignore him. Ignore him. Now let's get back to my dudes and go help him out. So let's run back around. Go, 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 go. Number-wise, uh, 12 to 10. I don't like that. But if we can get around and get some good charges into their men here, I will fucking wreck them. Come on. This guy's in the way. Just break him. Please push through him quickly. You keep pushing. Just get around here. You guys fight him. Charge into those archers. You charge there. You guys pull back. Okay, he's broken. Pull up to the side then. So you need to push through these archers first. Kind of get them to stop shooting. And charge them there. You guys pull around this way. Infantry, how are you holding? Uh, alright. Not the best, but alright. I need to get some of my charges up there to help out with their infantry. You're in the way. Keep running, keep running, keep running. They feel like they're losing. Come on, break their archers. Okay, that's not working as well as I would like. Pull out again. Get that charge. I need some chain routes. I need some routes. Because this is not how I want this to go. Oh, there we go. There's some. There's at least one guy breaking. Pull away again. Start trying to run them down. There we go. Yeah, run these guys down a little bit. You pull out again. I'm going to have you actually try and charge this guy. Run this guy down a little bit. Otherwise, where are we at? 22 to 27. That's better. I need you break. You pull back in here. You two focus on this cab unit. Please break and get the hell out of my face. Uh, let's see. 24 to 30. Good, that guy broke again. Okay, pull back once again. You guys I'm going to have kind of focus on maybe these dudes. You're doing decently well around here. I need you to just keep cycling in around here. Kill those guys. Kind of pull back once more again. Get your charge and then pull back out. You guys. I want to get a good charge up here. I need to break more of you. Because right now it's pretty close. 25 to 33. That's far closer than I'd like it to be. Let's bring you back down around this way. And have you run these men down. 
these guys have a better charge. And so I'll try and have them run in here. You need to run these guys down. Oh, there we go. That's what I want to see. Yeah, just get it, get it, get the charge, get the break, and then pull away. Because I don't need you to chase them down. I can have this guy do that for me. Oh, uh, those guys aren't broken right now. Kind of loop around them, ignore them specifically, but go for these guys. Let's have you go up this way. You kind of go up this way a little bit, and then we'll run this guy down. 28 to 40, that's better. General, this guy's got his back turned to us. Get a charge in on him. Uh, my infantry is doing much better now, at least on this left flank over here. You guys, good. I'm gonna pull you back this way. Well, actually, no, go around this way. Go around that way. Uh, these guys are breaking. Pull away. Hit them again. 29 to 46. You guys run them down. And then I'm gonna have you guys try and do another charge like this. One over here. One over here. Oh, actually, turn this back again. If he's turning his back again and try and get a good charge. Please break, damn you! Come on. The enemy are badly Almost. Wavering. There we go. Okay. I think we're at the tipping point. As a lot of you guys are breaking, for the most part, and I can kind of just start running you down. I need a good charge over here, though. Keep running these guys down. Yeah! Okay. That's probably get a good charge right here. There and there. Try and break these guys, and then that should be it. Aha! If we continue okay. like this, we I think they just literally have just their archers and all these guys. I'm gonna run all these men down first, and then we'll focus on the archers. But 30 to 80, never mind. I now just have to run them down. Oh, that's great. There we go. Now we've weakened their presence around Skaven. And maybe I can keep being cocky over here. <laughs> I need to humble myself. Deep breaths. Humble. Humble, humble, humble. I'm a humble red god. Yes, I've pushed back the Nords, the Empire, and the... The clan of forebears. Yes, this is a thing. But we must remain humble, otherwise we shall crumble under our hubris. So execute all of them. I, I'm pro oh god, yep, I'm pulling back. Oh good, they did ignore me around here. So Dak Fron is now mine. And Korhal here. Okay. Just all the defenses today. Because you guys here... I think as long as I get you to the ladders, we should be good. I got just the one cab unit. It's gonna kind of concern me, but I think we're good. We only got numbers yeah, about about fifty percent. I've got crowned warriors now instead too on the walls. So let's fight this. Should be able to hold you guys at bay as well. We've got two rams, a ladder, and a siege tower. As long as I can get their siege tower, their siege tower down, and the ladders taking it on. Since ladders are the only area that gets up, uh, I think my crowned warriors because they're a decent bit better than my other guys. If I put them where the ladders are going to be, I should do very well. Because you this guys are right over here. Because you guys have... Oh yeah, your attack is way fucking higher. Base 15. Ba sorry, base 13. You do have some experience, but... Uh, you guys up here and here. You two there. Uh, these guys are just going to be on... Uh, there. Just going to watch from the gates if you properly line up as I want you, uh, and then these guys too. So then we can just kind of line you up as we see fit. Uh, kind of be over around where the towers are. I can, well, I'm going to put you guys up here. Up there, so some more towers are active there and there, in case I need reinforcements. You guys will just stay down near the gates in case they get the ram up. And then my cab unit. Oh, come on. You have to be at the gate. You have to be at the gates. There you go. Okay. Start the battle. Run out. You guys need to immediately run for the Siege Tower. Siege Tower first. That's the easiest one to get up to the wall, technically. As once it's even close, even nearby, then it's going to be usable. The Ram is technically the next one. Pull back, pull back, pull back. Uh, be careful, this is, is my captain. Now, please don't grab your other Ram. They did grab the other Ram. Go, 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 loop around. This is just a game of tag. There we go. That should be the ramp. Uh, line up right there. And then run around. There we go. 
Just some nice maneuvering. Please don't pick your ram back up, you bastards. Okay. I think they didn't. I'm gonna wait until they send everybody up on the ladders, and then I'm gonna pull my calf back inside the city. Because for the moment, yeah, gates are closed. Rams aren't doing anything. Uh, you guys still chase me. Leave me alone, please. As I'm just trying to keep my guys close by to make sure that they don't use the ram. They're not actually using the ladder either. Huh. I, I want to wait. Just in case that you start trying to use the ram, but like... Oh, one of the rams burned! Yeah! Come on, catch the other one on fire too. That'd be great, because then I can stop worrying about you guys around here. Because they're not using the ladder for whatever reason. I think I can I think I can bring my like calf back inside. Let's do that, and then I think I just need to wait until they try and pull something. Cause either they're just gonna sit here and literally do nothing, because I think I glitched them, or they'll start rushing up the ladders and I'll have to beat them back that way. Wonderful, they went with the option of just sitting here and uh, letting all of their siege equipment burn <laughs> and not using the ladders. They actually even lost almost Thanks half of their army the just God. sitting there. Ah, the uh, lost seven guys to kill 630. I'll take it. I'll take it. Gives me some more time to properly build up Core Hall as a proper defense. As this is one of my largest cities right now, and if I can get it to some Blissed Towers, oh man, am I never going to lose it. I shouldn't. Because just this mod is always so wonderful with their siege towers. Oh, so wonderful. Now, can I please get back to my turn, my section of the map, I'll make sure the as I want to stop defending for today. I don't want every battle to be just defenses. I want us to actually be able to go on the offensive against some stuff. Because right now, at least with the forebearers, I've now taken another city from them. So I am doing some damage. I'm doing some lasting damage by taking cities. It's a little bit of a pain to get there, but... With us having Dak Fron now, I don't think it's large enough where I can actually recruit anything in there, maybe? But it's a castle. A castle will be a lot easier to defend than a city, and so we'll just have to see how that's going to work out. I do need to try and get a spy over to Stros Mackay. If Stros Mackay is not filled with a bunch of Restless League forces, I should get an army and take it. The sooner I take it, the better, because I don't want the High Elves to grab it. And I don't want anybody else to try and grab it, because that's going to be one of my few... Like, if I get the Restless League, my armies are going to drastically improve in quality, because they have so good... Their archers are so good. Uh, I will accept you. You're currently in Tanith. Okay. Yeah, because you guys... They've got, it says it's a full stack still, so that's something that does concern me. Because you've got you guys here. I wanted to try and get into Fort Sunkeep, but also... The Empire is man's Ooh. land. Attack me again, and I'll hunt you down. I could almost lure them out. How many turns do I have to sit here? Two turns? Okay. Um, I already have as many spies as possible. But the thing is, just you... Uh, okay, you guys are sieging us at Ghislaine. Ghislaine should be okay. Also, actually, I've got an army right here. I can easily crush you guys at Ghislaine. That I'm not worried about. Uh, you guys here... Ah, oh, yeah, you are too beat up. Okay, so Dakfron cannot recruit anybody. That sucks. Volnim, you can get some stuff. So try and recruit those. I hate that you only have one slot right now. Absolutely hate that. Let's try and retrain that unit. You guys here, I'll have you stay there for now. Um, Skaven? I want to take it. I don't think I'm going to be able to, because let's just compare, again, all of my enemies. Oh my god. Wow, okay. I am now equal with the forebears. That is good to see. That is very good to see. Okay, so I can't go for Skaven right now. So I'm going to pull you guys back to Fort River Point. I don't think it'd be wise for us to stay out here for too long. Um, you guys, let me just merge and retrain some of these dudes. Oh, actually, it's going to take four turns. I'd rather just recruit more guys. Do that. Could make my way up to Helldorn. I could do that. Stonemore, you guys, I think I might retrain. This guy needs to be retrained because he's got 13 guys. But uh, I can't retrain you. Just get some more archers. The archers are always very useful. You're still trying to... Oh, God. You're still trying to sneak your way back over here. Because I need to retrain you. Because I'm getting close in Tanith, right? 
Yes, I can retrain them in Tanith. Uh, what's the five turns and five? Oh. oh yes. Okay, so I can easily now bring you guys back over here. By the time you get over to Tanith, you'll be able to be retrained. Perfect. Uh, other than that, I think I need to upgrade my city watch. Yeah, let's upgrade the city watch here. Get some better inventory now, because I can't upgrade. Ooh, you guys can probably. Um, I can't get any better cab for now. Uh, that's the best we can get for this city level. Yeah, so we'll have to wait until it grows. Lane bond, can't do anything. Recruit some more guys. Um, Rose guard, you guys get some more infantry around there. Uh, you guys are still making your way over to... Oh, please. Please, please, please have the gates open. Because there's 40% chance. Ah, I didn't get it lucky. Okay, so I don't get to take Kavach right now. That sucks. But that city should pretty much fall guaranteed next turn. They have a really bad garrison around here. I think that'll be good. Uh, Core Hall. You guys barely lost anything, so you could keep just trying to recruit the units you were going for. Sanger Tor. Oh, man, I do need more dudes around here. Let's see, that's 28. Yeah, I'll retrain you. And I think I should retrain the cab, maybe. No, I get another unit. Get another unit. I'm a little worried with how low my troops are over there. Stonemore, you're good. Okay. And then you guys still can't build anything. I think I might have you guys try and go up towards Heldorn next time. Uh, have the orcs taken the cloud spring? They still haven't taken the cloud spring yet. I might still be able to get the Forsworn. Uh, we already started upgrading you guys. Um, ooh! Cyrodiil and Wares have broken their alliances. Nice! And Wayrus is now at war with Orsinium. That's good for me. Because I don't want any of them trying to join in on this war here. Okay. But I want to check one thing. Oh, actually, you guys just missed something in here. Uh, I need some cav. But I'll probably have you guys... Uh, yeah, don't get the better steel. Ooh! Knights of the Wheel and Knights of the True Can I get the dismounted like Knights of the Candle? I think I can. Is that based on... Um... I think that's in the church. Circle, Lily, Iron, Hour. No, I don't know if I can. Oh, it goes this way. Good. I don't know if I can get the Knights of the Candle as Forebear, as the Crown. I think only Forebears can get the access to them. Which is sad. Very sad. Ooh, at least I could get a Vampire thing here at some point, right? Oh, no, no, I could get that right now. Just let me put your Oh, shit! I didn't notice that uh, over here originally. Why did I not notice that? But no. Keep focusing on Cav. Cav is going to be the most important thing for us right now. I am curious. Oh, you guys don't have movement. Because what I want to do is you're going to go up here, sit in that ship, and then uh, next turn, what I'm going to try and do is... Ooh, that's the king. Uh, when I finish that mission, which will give me some units, I'll have you guys go back down around over here, try and explore Stros Mackay, see what they've got around there. You guys, I then will probably try and have you... Like, I just want to get some more men around here that will go group up with you guys. So I'll have it so that... Uh, I don't want to leave a Gath too vulnerable, but I do want to try and take some more men over here. I could just have some of you maybe try and hide forward. Uh, at least send this Gavin over here. At least send him over there, and then I'll leave them as they are here. But no, Lane Bond, you guys can't build anything, but let us take our forces out and let's just crush this force here. I can very easily do that with the guys I've got around here. Bullnim, I can't build anything. Just want to double check that. So let's take everybody but... Honestly, just you. Everybody but you, because I intend to kind of come back here and defend Lane Bond. But for now, let's go here, crush you. Uh, actually, I'm going to command with the other army... And I will command all the forces the instead of letting... Oh, shit, I forgot. Die, yeah, you're not going to be able to the lead there. The okay. I'm going to control you myself. I think we'll be good here. Uh, actually, no. I want to outnumber them immensely. That'll make it a lot easier. I shouldn't lose too many guys, I hope. You guys are commanded by a decent dude. He's got some decent command. Just need to take out their captain, kill them off, and then I will have uh, secured this area. Then, I might actually send some of these excess dudes over to the west and keep pushing towards Sentinel and everything. So let's start the battle here. Archers group up, fire arrows off. I have a lot of cabin here. 
God, I always have like six units of cav in these armies. It feels like that's like honestly like one of the best things to do with forebearers. Their archers actually feel like they're way better than they should be, uh, even though their stats are pretty bad. And so it's really all about maneuvering with your cav as Hammerfell it feels like. Like, I kind of find it funny. I'm starting to like this faction a lot more than I ever thought I would before. Because I know some of my earlier campaigns, I hated this faction because they were overpowered as shit. But now, like, they're actually pretty fucking fun. Like, they're pretty good to play. Their cab is great. Absolutely wonderful. And then, like, their archers aren't the best, which kind of bugs me because I usually like having some pretty good archers. But... I've been doing, I've, I've been getting cocky as fuck in this campaign because of how good my cab has been making these battles go for me. As like, I shouldn't be doing this well probably because of my cab, but I am, and so I'm happy. But no, you guys, I am gonna have you kind of be aggressive. I wanna surround them. So I'll have you guys go there. I'm gonna start having my infantry move up a little bit. So infantry kind of move up to about here. Archers as well. Because I'm going to try and take out their... Uh, pull back a little bit. I'm going to try and take out their captain with my cav, which he's kind of blobbing up now. Uh, should be this one. Let's see specifically. Is he on the edge again? No, he's just kind of sitting there. I'll wait then. You're not moving for whatever reason. I'm so glad you guys don't have that glitch anymore. Like, come on, move up. Yeah, for some reason, don't actually take the orders. But okay. Yeah, just move up. I'll have you guys maybe on uh, shootout stance. My archers can now open up on them, so I will just start trying to do as much damage as we can from over here. Let's see. One to zip. I don't like that you guys are just blobbing up. Stop blobbing up, please. Okay, I'm gonna have you guys come around here. I'm gonna kill this one unit here. Because you're out and alone. You can die really easily. This unit, I think I'm also gonna do the same thing. Like you guys run there. You kind of go right there. You kind of go right there. Now they're committing. Okay. My infantry, I'm going to have you guys start... Oh, uh, they're about to charge me, actually. So I'll let them try and charge. Try and do with that. You guys all charge this one unit here. He should break pretty easily. Their captain is now actually in the back over here. So if that's the case, let's come back around this way and make sure we kill him. As soon as he's dead, the enemy army is going to break pretty easily. That is 1 to 15 already. Holy shit. General flees like oh, he's already hands. running? Oh my god. That's just my infantry that kicked his ass. Oh, that's beautiful. Okay. My calf, come over here. You guys have already broken that one unit. I'll have you kind of line up over here. Get another proper charge into this line. Keep breaking them. Let's see. 3 to 29. Oh my god. That's beautiful. Yeah, you guys just ignore them for now. These guys should probably break. We've captured the enemy. Oh general. yes, that's what I want to see. To turn tail Goodbye, Captain. Okay, rest. now we just run everybody rest. down. Da, 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 da. My God, this I practically lost victory. nothing. That goes to only men of great virtue. <laughs> lost five percent of my forces to take out that entire army. Ah, beautiful. Okay, so that area is now at least secured. I can now try and send some guys over to the west and try and help us take Fort Sunkeep and then Sentinel. Honestly, if I take Sentinel from them, that's probably going to mean that they're just fucked. Because at that point, Sentinel's a good city for them. I've taken two mm, okay settlements from them so far. Volnum and Jackron. They're more valuable later on, but right now it probably isn't bothering them too much. It does help me and it'll probably cease their recruitment a little bit. You guys here, let's see. I need you. <sighs> what do I want? Again, I might just keep upgrading the stables. Just really hammer home upgrading my cav. Because what I want to try and do is lane bond. Honestly, I might just have it so that, like, this entire force just goes over this way. Most of it, at least. Still need to make sure I leave some guys in lane bond so that we've got some sort of defense there. But I've got a decent army over here that I can add you to. Let's actually... So, I've got over a stack here. Let's take doot, 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 and then you and you. Say so you stay in lane bond. That's a decent enough force to defend. And then let's take the rest of you. Uh, all of you guys go over this way. 
build up a watchtower. And then I had that one other general in Tanith of you watch over Lane Bond for me. There we go. And then I'll have it so that you will grab some men from Gath and from Aben Gora. And then you guys can make your way over to Fort Sunkey. I think that should work out well for us. Other than that, you guys, I'm a little worried here. I can get some more guys here and send you into Fort Such to try and make sure you can defend that. Rihad should be safe-ish uh, for the most part. So I don't think I'm going to have to worry too much about that over there. Okay, you guys can't build anything. Okay, okay, let's do one more end turn. And then I just kind of want to see where we leave off in the next uh, turn. Because right now, I think we're in a pretty good position against the Forebearers. I've done a lot of damage to them. Skyrim has continuously been pushed back. I really want to push up to uh, into Ellen here, right here. But I don't have the men with my king right now. At least you guys will be able to re train soon. Like, you guys will get to re-tan uh, in two more turns. Probably be able to retrain them relatively soon after that, but... I can start getting these guys, and these guys are fucking boss as hell, and I can't wait to start using them. As my enemies are starting to get some pretty good units for their infantry, and so I'm going to need some much stronger cavalry to defeat them. Now, please leave me alone for one turn end. Please. One turn end. Because I'm not being besieged anywhere. Okay, four bears are blockading my ports. Okay. I've already gotten past four bears. Okay, that's good. They, they're not sieging me anywhere. They're not trying to attack me anywhere. Cyrodiil... What's with that army? That is a piss poor army. I am insulted that you would defend to siege me with that. Cyrodiil Empire here. That's kind of more understandable with that army. It's equal size. I'm probably honestly going to push out of Sankator. I'm not going to let them siege me with that. That is such a pitiful army. There's no way. Skyrim's got another good army. Yeah, Stonemore, I will have to wait. Because they've got that other force outside. I don't think I have night battles, so I can't sally out and push one back. And then push the other back. But otherwise, no. We got through one fucking turn. <laughs> without issue. Thank you. Thank you. I'm curious. Now that I upgraded my cav... It, are those what you, the units I'm going to get for military? Please. Please give me some of my heavy cav as free units. That would be amazing right now. Because usually it selects some, one of your best units that you can recruit. And one of the best units I can recruit right now is my cavalry. Like, come on. I'm going to finish that mission just now. And so I'm going to hope that those guys can... Come on, what is it going to be? So, Bride presented. I'll accept that. Oh, no, shit. I got vampires. Oh, even better. Oh, yes. Oh, that's even better. Like, I don't usually have, like, insane infantry, but some of you guys... Mm. Mm -mm -mm. I will take it. Because you guys here... Oh, I can't get to... Well, maybe I can. I think I can start CG... Oh. Didn't mean to do that, but uh, that's good enough. Because then I can just make sure you guys can get over here. I have you there. Actually, there's one thing I'll be trying to do. I did finish that mission. That's what they gave me. Uh, am I going to... Not be able to siege it. No, I could I could do it with this. So let me just try one thing before we're done. Because I want to try and see. Oh damn it! I should have moved you. Because you guys aren't better than them. So um, okay. You guys, yes, yeah, so let's siege. And can you get in here? I just want to see if he can get in here because I might be able to just walk into the city here next video. How you gonna do, my man? Can you get in the city? Is it an M or not? It's, I think it's Cameron. Cameron. Cameron Tahoud. Please survive. You have like 52% chance. There you go. Okay. And is the gates... You can't check there. But I can try and check with these guys. Yeah! Okay. So we will be able to assault that next turn. Next video. Take Fort Sunkeep and then... Sendel's weak! Sentinel's really weak, but oh man, I love that I got some of these vampire units. Okay, but I think I'm going to end this video for now. We got a lot set up for the next video. The Assault of Kavach, Assault of Fort Sunkeep. I can send all these guys probably up here to reinforce you guys and keep pushing into Skaven maybe. But 
I'm gonna end this video for now. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this. If you guys did, maybe like, comment, and or subscribe. If you guys did not, please let me know why so I can try and improve. Also check out my Discord. It's a great way to interact with the rest of my community and get updates on videos. Additionally, there are plenty of other ways. You can teach from my channel in the description so you can check that out. This is Rampant, and I'll see you guys next time.